when NTs realize low emotional intelligence is not something to be proud of. The one that should change is me. Greatest mysteries of the world. Why do introverted intuitives stop being happy when they are 12? When an INTJ tries to cheer you up. This is the worst day of my life. The worst day of your life so far. XNTP. A good idea they are trying not to forget. XNTP's brain. <coughs> IXFJ applying for a job like. Interviewer. Why do you want to work in customer service? Me. Well, I'm really good at apologizing for things that aren't my fault. Who are we? Introverted intuitives. What do we want? What do we want? Where are we? What does it mean? Who am I? Family. It is either us or your career. XTJ. There's the door. What makes people feel powerful? Money. Status. When their MBTI type gets praised on websites or Instagram posts. When you ask someone if they have heard of MBTI, fully expecting them to say no, but they say their type instead. When an INFP invites you to his or her birthday party, you are invited to suffer. INTPs. ENTPs. Being able to talk to people. How to recognize a stroke. Twisted mouth. Arm paralysis. Incoherent speech. I'm both introverted and extroverted so this makes me an ANFJ. XSFJ. Don't argue. XSTJ. Argue your side. XNTJ. Argue the opposite side for fun. XNTP. Argue both sides and win both arguments. By the way, if you like the video so far, share it with your friends. Or, to be more realistic, with some strangers on some MBTI related Discord server. ENTPs. I'm just here to argue. Change my mind. ENTPs. INTPs who want to appear human. When someone says, because I said so, in an argument, INTX, you are not a clown, you are the entire circus. ISTP, ESTP, ENTP who provoked their fight. Society, what could be better than having family and kids, NT, silence, and money. ENFP, if you found out you have one day left, what would you do with it? ESFJ, say goodbye and mend my relationships. ESTP, something illegal. INFJ, accept my fate. ENTP, I would message 10 people on Facebook saying, if they didn't forward the message to 10 people, I would die tomorrow. ESTP, that's fucking awesome. Can I change my answer? I don't smash me, mate. I, smash I, I me. Don't wanna, I yeah, don't smash me. I Hello, darkness, my old friend. I don't want to smash me, mate. I don't want to smash me. I don't want to smash me. Because I'm pushing softly. I don't want to smash me. Any man God made, you know what I mean? And not only that, I'll whoop God as well. Smile to Jen, yeah. <laughs> because when he tired, he always give up. He moved to books and he tap there. Oh, you, tap the like you tap like chicken. You tap like chicken four times. I told you guys, everything I'm gonna change 6 October and I do this. Alhamdulillah, thank you so much. All right guys, so as I'm sure you've heard, straight after the fight finished, um, there was a brawl that happened, a lot was going on and we can get into that aspect, but the fight itself was absolute magnifique. Fourth round, Khabib tapped him out, easy. Now let's go to the Twitterverse and do some live reacting. Look Joe, this is not what we trained for. Emotions got the better of him today. Yes, this is the same bear, or maybe he's grown up a bit, that fought Khabib when he was young. Drake realizing that he'd left his Russian flag back at the hotel. Exactly. Drake is a sellout. Give him some money, give him a flag and he'll follow you. Talk about bias mate, this guy's supposed to be the president of the UFC. After the fight, Dana spoken to Conor McGregor, he's spoken to everybody else. When asked have you spoken to Khabib? Have you talked to Khabib? Right, since I have the... not. Okay. No sir, I have not. They are withholding Khabib's purse. 
They are not withholding Conor McGregor's. They looked at the footage. All right, let's have a little look at the footage then. All right, guys, so here we can clearly see the first punch was thrown by Conor McGregor. Conor refused to press charges. Then look at the footage then. Guys are going to say mean things to each other. It's the fight business. They're not mean words. What if the other guy was a Jew and the comments were anti-Semitic? What if the other guy was a person of color and the words were racist words? But just because it's Islam, sadly, they're just mere words. I mean, there's going to be fines. There's going to be... Uh, God knows what, you know? Can these guys get visas and get back in the country? He wasn't disgusted when... When I called his father oh. a quivering coward. Which, which, they were chased from the land to the edge of cliffs. Yeah, my rat! Ali Abdul Aziz, my terrorist. Ali, Ali, terrorist Ali. Like, I don't understand how people can talk about I jump on the cage, you know? What about he talk about my religion? He talk about my country? He talk about my father? He come to Brooklyn and he broke bus. He almost killed a couple people. What about this? Khabib can't strike with Connor. Oh, look at him scurrying away. That was the one that made us go, yes! A photo for the ages. Look how humble he's made Connor. Look at the way he's just sitting there, just looking. Honestly, hand on heart, he looks like a homeless beggar. Watch this to understand the pretext. Tension between the two have been rising. Look at that. That's when he threw out his bus. McGregor attacked the bus. Then he gave himself uh, into the police. McGregor's whole team went to beat Khabib. Khabib went alone to beat McGregor's whole team. Summary of McGregor and Khabib fight. Enough! You are all of you beneath me. I am a god, you dull creature. And I will not be bullied by that. Connor fans talking about Khabib's behavior is hands the best flavor of irony. <laughs> exactly. Look at that. Conor McGregor got destroyed. He took Khabib lightly and he paid for it. Forget what happened outside the ring. Khabib is on another level to Connor. Honestly, when we're watching this, we're feeling sorry for Connor. For a split second. But then that second passed very quickly. Let this be a lesson to everyone in the world. Do not bully someone for months about their religion, values, family, friends, country and culture. Then be shocked when they explode. Do not poke a bear, pun intended, and then not expect it to smash you. Honestly, look at his face. My God, so much fair. So much fair. Up close footage of Khabib jumping out of the octagon. <laughs> Am I the only one that thinks this was awesome? The eagle finally came out to fly. Well memed, my brother, well memed. When Khabib jumped out of the cage, Drake decided to become a Muslim. <laughs> Drake was acting like a hard man trying to go after Khabib. This was pure comedy. What's he doing outside when this is going on inside? And why is he walking so slowly? Pathetic, mate. Honestly, Khabib's action saved Connor's ass tonight. Distracts everyone from the fact that Connor got mauled during the fight and he got away with cheating multiple times. One of the best picture in the century. Whew, he's eating that fist, mate. McGregor called Khabib a racist slurs, his manager a terrorist, insulted his chosen faith, launched a metal dolly into a bus injuring fighters. But let's all act like Khabib is the worst guy ever because he jumped a fence to shut up a mouthy Irish bloke. Say what you want about Khabib and his post antics, but he made a lot of people happy today back home. <laughs> Trey coming for Khabib after the fight with Conor McGregor. <laughs> Connor punched a member of Team Khabib, which is why he got punched back. It would have been nice to see Khabib take the high road, but every man has a breaking point, and Connor's came in the fourth round. <laughs> Khabib versus a bear. That should be the next fight, guys. That would probably be a better competition than what we saw in the morning. Now here's the best meme I've come across. Hello, my name is Connor McGregor, and today I went to Jahannam. Chilling in Jahannam. See you soon. I met a backwards guy there I never my backwards who made me realize that I'm not a god after all. And not only that, I'll whoop god as well. He suffocated me, neck cranked me, humbled me, and then his boys knocked the living snot out of me. Both ends and all. I now want to go Jannah. Someone help me. All right, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Nearly at the 100k mark. Until next time, guys. Assalamu alaikum. What did you say was the...
prediction of Khabib winning? 100, you said 100. And how much did you say? 80, 20, I yeah. I regret that decision. Thank you.